Hello, my name is Mike Gorman, and I have the privilege of serving as president of your Salem Community College, the affordable, quality, and empowering personalized educational opportunity. Today we want to talk to you about our restart. As you are aware, back in the spring, due to the COVID virus, we went into a remote learning mode. That is, we are operating with students at home, faculty at home, and the skeleton staff here on campus. As we have progressed with this disease and found our way into coping with it a little bit more adeptly, we have restarted the campus. John Morrison, our Director of Public Safety, has been responsible for the chairing of the committee to restart the campus. As such, he had to put together a comprehensive plan that was submitted to the Office of the Secretary of Higher Education, which received very strong endorsement and has allowed us to restart here on our campus. Thank you, Dr. Gorman. Students, faculty, and staff are following the rules. They're wearing their masks. They're maintaining social distance. On the few occasions when that has not happened, a simple reminder has corrected the situation. Um, students and employees are sanitizing equipment and keyboards. And we'd like to thank you all for acknowledging our shared responsibility to keeping the campus safe. Here are scenes from the first few days of classes. Students are on campus for science labs, select art courses in class. In addition, nursing students come here by appointment for hands-on practice. If everyone continues to adhere to the guidelines, uh, including stay home when you're not feeling well, we'll have a healthy and safe semester. As you can see, the quality of John Morrison's leadership has allowed us to restart. He has led this team to help us get organized and postured to make sure everyone remains safe on campus. He's very skilled at this because he has been part of the Department of Health and Human Services as an operations manager. Recently, in the spring, he was assigned to the Javits Center in New York to set up operations to receive patients related to COVID-19. His experience has made this whole venture much more successful and we owe him a debt of gratitude. We want to thank John and his entire team for bringing this all together so that we could successfully restart. And please stay tuned to our website for any changes that may occur as we go forth in this COVID-19 era. Thank you so very much.